first things first, before we get this get ready with me underway. Oh my god, sometimes I talk so weird. <laughs> so this is my wig that I got from China Lace Wig. It is a green kind of bob. And um, I'll leave all the information to the wig in the description box. So as you can see, it is beautiful. And it is a pre-plucked lace. So all I'm going to be doing is bleaching the lace. So I'm going to be using this um, powder. The powder is blue. And I encourage you guys to use blue powder if you can. Because when you're finished bleaching it, it doesn't have that like coppery kind of brassy color you know so I'm applying it all over my lace now don't make fun of me because I can't find like my little applicator brush so I had to use the tail of a comb I mean it worked okay innovation at its finest <laughs> so this is what it looks like when I'm all done knots have been bleached and now I can go ahead put it on my mannequin head so I put a nice definitive part Look how beautiful it looks. It looks really good, you know. That was a very nice, definitive part I made. I want to add a little bit of this got to be spray because I want it to stay and I want it to dry in this formation. At least going in the general direction because I hate trying to do it like when it's on my head. So I'm just going to dry it and make it dry faster with the blow dryer because ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time. And I'm going to just add some curls to it. So it came with like a wavy kind of looking curl. It wasn't curly, it was wavy. But I didn't know how to create the waves, so I kind of just curled it, however. Yeah. Comment down below, like, if I want to achieve those waves, can you guys tell me how I can do that? Because I didn't really like the end result of how the curls looked. I wanted the curls to be a bit higher, but I don't know what happened. I think it was because I did it on the mannequin, and I couldn't really see what it was looking like. All right, well, don't worry about that. <laughs> So I'm going to put on my stocking cap on my head. I did the got to be method. You guys have seen that a thousand times already. And I am just going to pull my lace frontal on. Beautiful. Look at that. I didn't tweeze anything. I mean, it could use a little bit of tweezing. But for like doing nothing at all, that isn't too bad, you guys. Not too bad. Hey, guys. So, now I'm going to be doing my makeup. It is the next day. I totally stepped on my hair and I have to recolor it. So I thought I'd do a little chit chat with you guys. Um, but what are we chit chatting about? Do I ever know? Do I ever know? My mom's in the building. Hey mom! Mom, you can speak. So I am just doing my eyebrows, as you can see. Okay, I'm back. I just did my eyes. I outlined my eyebrows. So guys, do you guys do the top of your eyebrows with um, concealer or no? Because I do. And I don't know if I can live without it. Like, I like the way it looks. It looks so nice and sharp and clean. Should I like not do the top? Weird. Does it look artificial to you guys? Like, I guess I haven't asked you. Does it look weird? Like, do you feel that I should not outline the top of my eyebrow? Look close, you guys. How does it look? Anyway, for some reason, I feel like doing a summery eye look, even though it's winter. So I'm using this yellow first. And I have this Morphe palette. And I'm going to use an orange color from it. Next. Do you guys see that? Okay, maybe it's going to come back folly. I'm going to use this color right here. Okay. And now I'm going to use... I'm gonna use this brown. Yeah. Brown like the leaves. <laughs> oh my god. So guys, I think I have insomnia. I cannot sleep at night. Like honestly. Babe. 
basically the moment I lie down, I can literally hear the heart, the beat of my heart in my ears. It's so crazy guys. I don't know why. The thing is, I feel nice and sleepy when I'm driving or like when I'm editing my YouTube videos, I can feel the feeling of sleep coming over me. But for some reason, when I go to lie down in my bed at night to sleep, I just don't feel like sleepy anymore. Yes guys, so comment down below, do you guys like have trouble sleeping? I really have trouble sleeping and it's so annoying and I honestly don't know what to do. So I put on my vision board that from now on, I want to go to bed at um, a certain time of the day. It's just coming out. Yeah, so I put on my vision board that I want to go to bed at like 11 o'clock from, from now on, right? And it's like, I don't know if the anxiety of feeling like I'm running out of time to go to sleep is giving me anxiety to go to sleep, you know what I mean? Because I have it on my vision board that I want to go to sleep at a certain time. So I'm feeling like maybe taking it off my vision board so I don't feel pressured about trying to meet my goal on my vision board, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean? So yeah, comment down below if you guys suck at sleeping at night. And let me know if there's anything that you guys do to help that or to, you know, like feel sleepy. Like what do you guys do? I might get one of the kids to sleep with me. Maybe that's why. Maybe I need someone to sleep with. So I might like sleep with Naomi or Jordan or something. Yeah? Yeah, yeah now. I'm going to use this palette. There's some shimmery colors in there that I really like. And I'm going to put it on my lid. The annoying thing about my lid is that when I put stuff on it, it touches the top of my eye. So I have to be like really careful. No, you can't even see anything. Let me get something else. Alright, I'll put this color. There we go. Is this gonna match my hair? <laughs> Seems fine. I'm gonna put a little bit of mascara. I only put a, the littlest amount because I just want to give my eyelashes some body to hold my um, false, lash false lashes. So that's why I do that. So I'm gonna let those dry before I put on my lashes. Actually, I'm gonna put contact lenses in. I'll be right back. So I got these contact lenses a while ago. I don't even have the right box for them. They're from Iris, and these are the color um, Glam Gray. So I'm gonna put them in. Okay, so they're in. Contacts are always weird because it takes getting used to and it's like I don't know are my eyes built for contacts I don't know but these are cute I don't want to be too Halloween -y though because like Halloween is over at this moment this is weird looking at myself like this right now so let's move on to skin <laughs> I have this sample that Miss Rosh Posh gave me and I have a sample because I normally use I normally use cover effects, but I want to use my NARS. So I'm going to use my NARS today. I already put some primer on my face. So I'm going to go ahead and do this real quick, like real quick, fast motion, okay? So one of my contacts was moving, but I think it's because I accidentally turned it inside out and put it on inside out. So, um, note to self. So I have these lashes on and they are the same lashes from the same pack. For some reason, this lash is just way bigger. It's just way bigger. And I don't know why that is. Like I'm sure that these are the same two lashes from the same package and this lash is just enormous. 
I have some NYX um, lip color. What the heck? These eyelashes are gonna drive me crazy. Ta-da! And I'm done. So, I think this is pretty cute. I actually really like this color. It's perfect for the season. I feel like the brighter colors are like summery. But this is cute for fall. So, how do I look? Cute? I think so. Alright you guys, so this is the end of my Get Ready With Me video and I hope you guys enjoyed it. So, um, leave your comments below, let me know what y'all think and the information to this hair company is down below. It's China Lace Wig and I do have a coupon code so make sure you use the coupon code right here and use the description box. <laughs> use the link! In the description box so I'm gonna go now I, I don't I don't really know where I'm going but um maybe the gym <laughs> all right you all so have a good day have a good night love you